Hey there. In this video, we will cover Vela's pricing model and the details you need to manage subscriptions for your shops. To begin, you will find all of the details and account settings in the lower left hand of your screen. Clicking through to our account settings, we'll see our personal details where we can update and edit where we wish. We'll also see the billing tab that will contain all of your billing and subscription information. Once in billing, we will see several important details. We'll see how many shops are connected to our account, regardless of their subscription status. We'll also see how many shops are currently subscribed to active plans. And on the far right of the screen, we'll see the total monthly spend for those subscribed shops. Below, we'll see all of the connected shops, including their listings count, the monthly fee, and the due date for their billing cycle. If we click through to manage, this is where we'll be able to unsubscribe shops or pause our subscriptions wherever we wish. We'll also see where on the price sync tier they stand. If we want to unsubscribe, we simply need to click unsubscribe rather than delete the shop itself, and we'll be able to resubscribe to a plan whenever we want in the future. To subscribe a shop where the trial has ended, we'll simply click on upgrade, where we'll once again see where on the pricing tier this shop falls, and we'll see an option on the bottom right to upgrade the shop, which will subscribe the account. In cases with Etsy shops, the subscription process is easy and happens all within Bella. And if we now refresh our browser, we'll see that this updated subscription status will be reflected in our dashboard. We'll now see a new due date for our next payment. And that's all we need to do to subscribe this Etsy shop. To subscribe our Shopify shop, it's a very similar workflow. We're clicking upgrade will then prompt us to authorize Bella through our Shopify account. So we'll click through using the login credentials for that Shopify shop, where we'll simply need to approve the recurring charge, where once again, we've successfully subscribed and can easily unsubscribe or pause at any point in the future. We'll now see all four shops are subscribed successfully. On the bottom of the screen, we'll be able to see the historic billing for each connected shop. And you'll also note, this is where you'll find invoices in cases where you need those for your own records. If we want to learn more about Bella's pricing model, we can also go to the homepage where we'll see pricing at the top. Clicking through, we'll be able to see Bella's pricing model, which is based off of listing count, within set tiers. If your listing count changes within a billing cycle, the updated pricing will be reflected in your next monthly subscription. All newly connected shops, of course, receive a one week free trial with no commitments. Scrolling below, we'll also see other FAQs related to billing where you can learn more about the details. So that's all you need to know about Bella's pricing and subscriptions. Thank you for joining us.